it's difficult to believe uh, that this day is here. Uh, what you all are about to see, many of you for the first time, is the result of literally thousands, and in the case of our generous donors, tens of thousands of passionate Cal faithful who believed in the need, who believed in the need for facilities that provided conditions for success for our student athletes, and who believed in the need for a stadium that provided a safe, secure venue for our community to gather, and a facility that provided customer amenities to create a compelling game day atmosphere. really talked about accountability. Uh, accountability to yourself, accountability to your team, your teammates, and to the program. And uh, really it kind of was, was far reaching and accountability for everything that they do, uh, be it in the classroom, on the football field, socially, uh, just, just really uh, wanted to, to impress on everybody that we're here, team matters, and uh, you want to be accountable to everybody around you as well as yourself. We went through the, all the hardest parts of camp, you know, early on, and, and um, young guys feel a little more comfortable with the plays, and, you know, it was, it was a, a smoother mesh for us, I would say. Say it, hit. That's it, good. All right, DeAndre, get a break. Here we go. It was tough. It was mentally tough. Uh, you know, day in and day out, you got to work hard, uh, either lifting or, or out practice doing two a day. So um, it was one of those things that you just had to be mentally tough and, and push yourself through it each and every day. And, uh, you know, you just have to know that uh, the bigger goal is, is right in front of you. And now it's only six days away. Every day um, we came out here uh, trying to get better. Winning, winning the day was uh, pretty much our motto. Uh, winning the day, winning the rep, um, winning the practice. Um, I think that was that was our motto uh, throughout the whole camp, and uh, I think we did. In summer camp, you know, you're really trying to uh, build good habits, and when season comes comes around, it's really about taking those good habits and making it faster. Let's go from the top. There you go. Nice job, Alex. It's more about the uh, mental game now, less about the physical hitting, since we got that all done in camp and stuff. Uh, more about the uh, installing plays and, and uh, getting to know the defense and, and just um, knowing what you've got to do on every play on, on, on different downs and different uh, situations. Camp goes for a month and you know it's from 6 o'clock in the morning till 11 at night every single day. Um, you know, so that's a grind, but the season actually is, is I think even more so, you know, because when the game, now you have the game excitement, you have the game preparation that goes on. Um, if you ever wanted to push something back in camp, you could, but now that's game week, you can't. I mean, it's just, it's, it's 24 seven, literally, and, and, you know, for three months here. And so, you know, going into it that, you know, you're kind of going into your cave and uh, you know, you're gonna be here, you're gonna sleep here, you're gonna do everything it takes to make sure that we put the players in a position to be successful. And, and so, uh, you know, my staff does a great job of, of preparing and, and uh, are very dedicated and committed uh, to what they're doing. Go, 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 It's definitely important for us to, you know, interact with uh, the fans and stuff because they, you know, they come out and support us each and every week. 
and uh, you know they always see us with our helmets on and stuff and they don't really you know see us our faces and things like that so it's it's fun to actually talk and and sit and uh, interact with them and you know so they can they can get to know what a football player's life is like. It's significant for me because you know we spend all the time here on the field you know nobody's in the stands right now and just that one day a year where you actually get to interact to, with, with the fans face to face, you know, means a lot to myself and to the team. Take care of yourselves. We have a lot of support from the fans and, you know, families and friends. And this is just a big event, you know, to start off the season. And the players love it, the fans love it. Everyone is just here just to, you know, Support and enjoy Cal football. Yeah, they, say, they say we co starters. We'll never have a start. Okay. No, we just don't miss yeah, a beat. you are. Fan Appreciation Day is uh, our way of like giving back to them, interacting with them, and uh, it's humbling as well to, to be looked up at upon by little kids and stuff, and they want you all to rap. And so it was really fun. Oh, absolutely. <laughs> Hi, Coach. How are you? <laughs> I love connecting with the fans on Fan Appreciation Day. It's it's one of the best days of the year. Uh, they're really excited for football to get started. It's amazing, though, being here 11 years now, of seeing how little kids have grown up. You know, you see them, you know, and they have pictures from 10 years ago when they were there for their first one. And, and uh, you know, so it, it's great to see the support that's there for the fans, to see the enthusiasm for the team, for the season. And uh, so it's always great to, to be able to shake hands and be able to visit with them a little bit. Yeah, Nine and twenty. <laughs> so, easy, so fairly. They tell me this year that uh that you're gonna uh, be all Pac-12, and um you know you have the fan appreciation day. You know what does this do for the fans when they come see you and throw pictures and uh you know just very excited what you've done for Cal Bears all four years of your career. Well, you know. We, we, we really on live right now? No, we can't be doing it like this. What's up? You ask us questions. I'll play around. And I'll be playing around with CJ the whole time. It's focusing on the details and just the small things of each player, like uh, your alignment, uh, your first step, getting off the ball fast, knowing what route or your uh, blocking assignment. So it's just the little things, making sure you're focused, not worried about the big picture, like being in the stadium, just focus on your task and uh, getting that done. Nevada offensively is a great team. Um, they were highly ranked in many categories last season. And so uh, what it comes down to is trusting the coaches. They're putting together a great game plan for us, um, trusting one another that we're going to take care of our assignments. And um, as a defense, really relying on it, us being a unit together uh, to stop such a great offense. Mindset is kind of get set on set on the season, set on the next game. Uh, I think so. Um, my mindset now is just to beat Nevada. I'm ready to go at Nevada. Um, my mindset in camp was just to get better every day um, and um, try to uh, progress with the offense. It comes down to making sure that we're disciplined on defense and we have all phases of their offense covered because it's like the triple option. So we have to make sure that we tackle well and then offensively protect the football and, and uh, keep the defense off the field. Whoa! 
it'll bring back a sense of home, like a sense of comfortableness, I guess, comfort, I guess, you know. Just coming back in the North Tunnel, you know, hearing that drum play, hear the crowd roar, you know, it's just gonna feel real good. teammates and basically your family and you know if you are nervous they'll be able to pick you up and uh, push you through it and things like that you know it's gonna be it's gonna be loud and crazy in here when it comes on Saturday but uh, you know we'll definitely get through it and people will push each other and we're about to have fun out here that's for sure confidence that we will prepare all week uh, very well uh, to, to take the field and uh, really the focus at that time is just everything about game time everything about the discipline that it takes and the strategies that go with it and uh, the motivation for the team and uh, you know it's it's just all about game time when you go down that tunnel you try to block everything else out and just really focus on what your team's all about uh, how the players are preparing, making sure they're comfortable, making sure they're, they're ready to go. And so really all the focus is 100% on the team.